headed out bright and early for a hike at Bryce Canyon. Are you guys awake? No. Uh -huh. Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't look no. like it. <laughs> we're just about to start our hike that's about three miles and we're getting a nice sunrise right as we're getting started. Here. So Navajo Loop is this line and Wall Street Loop is this line. Okay. 0.6 and 0.7 miles. Okay. This one's not open in the winter and we want to take advantage of it. It's more. Okay. Go oh, back. Levi, look at this. I'm going to go with that. Look at this. I don't know exactly where our path is going to go, but do you see this? Mm. Amazing, huh? It's starting down here. Wow. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. Whoa. It's like that it like exploded there. It does look like it exploded there. We're making our descent. It'll be harder coming up. Okay. Oh yeah, he didn't have to bend over at all. Look at this tree. That is nuts. It made it out. Up and out. Sunrise, wait, is it sunrise or sunset? We made it from one to the other. Whew. Oh my goodness, it does. It's like a crab. Oh wow. That's just something else, isn't it? Stopping for snacks before we do a little more um, exploring. I know, Dad's gonna take my keto chow. I got my uh, blueberry pie keto chow and my cute new blender bottle that matches uh, that we're sharing. And then got a Marigold Foods protein bar. I think this one is uh, like chocolate chip coconut. And you're drinking your electrolytes. No, it's your electrolytes. That's right, you're stealing mine. It just occurred to me why these are called Pure Joy. It's because they're a take on almond joy. Because there are almond flour in there, coconut, and chocolate. Genius. Oh yeah, more sandstone. It's everywhere. Oh, it's got brace the name on it. Oh, those are pretty. Oh, what is that? That's so cute. Oh, it's got a little gold miner in there. Those are cool. Just looking at some gift shops and Oh my goodness, these mugs are so cute. One more short little hike today to Mossy Cave. And apparently there's a waterfall. So, cave and a waterfall. Okay. Here it is. I'm oh, we can't really go in. Yeah. 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 Can't go in. We were in more of a cave yesterday in Zion. Yeah. It's dripping. That's why there's moss. Yep. Yeah, well, that's it. Oh. Apparently it looks like this sometimes. Oh. There's a like drippy water coming through. Oh. And big stalagmites. Yeah, that would be cool to see. It's making my feet ache. Oh. Is that cool? I thought it, I thought it would be warmer. It is not even noon yet, but I have surpassed my step goal already by 1,800 steps. So we made it home from Bryce Canyon. Wow, that was so amazing. I had never been there, my husband had never been there. Obviously the kids had never been there and it was so worth it. It was incredible. Um, so we love that, but we are exhausted. 
We um, we did come back into Pangwich, uh, where our Airbnb is, and we went to that smokehouse, it's like cowboy smokehouse restaurant, and it was pretty good. Um, we got some smoked tri-tip. I was able to get it by the pound, so we got a pound of that, and I have a bunch left over. I think they gave me more than a pound. It was a huge pile. Um, so we have some of that left over for another time. We're gonna relax right now. Several people are taking a nap. We're having kind of quiet time. We're gonna, you know, do some preparing for tomorrow, this evening. I ha I'm, I need to cook up some stuff. Um, I baked a bunch of potatoes yesterday to have with our steak dinner, and I need to go ahead and maybe fry them or something, or like cut them up and roast them so they're more like fries so that we can have some maybe for dinner tonight if we need any dinner tonight. Um, everyone's pretty full from lunch. Um, or we can have them in the morning for breakfast. I have some leftover steak from last night, so that's all cut up, so it'll be easy. To, I, I don't mind eating cold steak, so I'll probably eat some of that tomorrow for breakfast or possibly lunch. Um, oh, I had bought some sausage at the store yesterday thinking I'd make it for breakfast this morning, but we left early enough that I did not get that done. So I'll probably cook that tonight so that those potatoes and that sausage will be ready to eat in the morning um, or whenever we need it. I can just cook it up and we can take it. Sausage is another thing. I don't mind eating cold out of the fridge either. Uh, so that'll work out fine. So I need to cook those things up this evening. But besides that, we're just kind of relaxing. I'm trying to edit some videos <laughs> so I can get some of these trip videos out because I have a lot filmed so far and not a lot edited. I need to I need to get to work on that. Um, so it's going to be a pretty quiet day. Um, I as far as my step goal, I am currently over 18,000 steps, which is pretty high for me. I hit my step goal by do you have the hiccups? <laughs> I hit my step goal, I think, before noon. I think it was around 11 a.m. So that, is, that means it was a very busy day. We just ran to the little grocery store real quick to get last few foods. Uh, there he is. Last few foods before tomorrow because we're planning not to stop anywhere until tomorrow evening. So we need to have enough for dinner tonight, for breakfast and lunch tomorrow. So we got a few more little things and then... I wanted to walk along the um, front of the stores here because we haven't done that yet because uh, we're staying above the quilt shop. So I want to at least peek into the quilt shop real quick. Hi. We got a little salon. You want to say hi? Hi. And let's see what, what else we see. Straight Arrow Saddlery. Saddlery. Oh, the Flying Goat Cafe. I was wanting to get coffee here, but I didn't make it happen. Oh, look, there's the Flying Goat right there. Look at that. See the flying goat? I see it. It's right there. Another one. Yeah. All right, what's this? This is the Thunder Horse Mercantile. Thunder Horse is the name of the other Airbnb. Oh, that's right. Maybe that's owned by the same person that owns the Patches Quilt Shop. Yeah. All right, so this, oh, we can't look in, at least not on this window. Patches Quilt Shop. The, um, the Airbnb. Oh, they're open. No pets allowed. Hello. How are you doing? Doing well. So they said that they sell the panels. Oh yeah, this, the panels yeah. of fabric know, for the so cool. um, the national park quilts that are upstairs. Like every bed had one of these national park quilts. We should have. We should get the Bryce Canyon one, top right. Well, well, you, the idea is you get the whole thing and you make it into a quilt. But then they had the bigger, um, the bigger ones of these, and they were yeah. pillows. Yeah. So that was fun too. Oh man, this is like, I, I worked in a quilt shop. Did I tell, ever tell you that? No. I worked in a quilt shop before I got married to dad in uh, West Lynn. Oh, What's see that? these, these are big. You can make big pillow. ones. Oh, that's cool. That look, that's very yeah. skinny. That's exactly what it looks like. Oh yeah. The hoodoos. Oh, those are so cool. Those are so cool. This is a big quilt shop. This is not, not small at all. Look at this, Tal. The place over there. Ooh. That is so cool. Mm -hmm. 